Erin contacted me from Mad Minis and she said that she would like to send us these to try. Uh, we actually do not have these in our area and the stores that are listed on the website uh, are not in our area. These are located at uh, Harris Teeter. I'm going to give you these names in case you have one of these stores in your area. Harris Teeter, Hybe, Lunds, and Byerly's. I don't know that name at all. Stewart's Shops, Whole Foods. We do have a Whole Foods. Mm -hmm. uh, Marino's, Ingles, and King's. Yeah, we do we, have a Whole Foods. We do have Whole Foods, but it is way across town. It is like 40 minutes of traffic on a good day and this is the kind of thing where you put it you even if we put it in a cooler it probably would get very very soft uh, by the time we got home so this um, unfortunately we wouldn't be able to buy it there but hopefully uh, they'll um, um, stretch their wings and maybe uh, be available in some other stores before too long some of you saw my box opening uh, during the vlog of these and you said that you've already tried them. So I think that's awesome So if you've tried them, of course at the end, I would love for you to comment Let me know which ones you've tried which ones your favorite all that stuff. Um, I'm always curious. So um, These were all free um, But I will we will always give you our honest uh, opinion of these uh, I have black raspberry and chocolate and I have uh, vanilla, and then I have blondie. So we're gonna and these try are all them. sixty calories. We're gonna try them in this order. Yes, these are all sixty calories. These are they're um, twelve bites in a box. Yes, twelve bite sized treats. Um, they are um, ice cream. It says on the bottom, it is uh, vanilla ice cream, vanilla cookie sandwiches. Yeah, Those this one's vanilla vanilla. This one's van chocolate vanilla. That one's chocolate chocolate. That one's chocolate blue black raspberry. It says. It says, Mad Minis, a big idea and a little package. We saw a need for a perfect bite-sized treat made from good ingredients, no junk, hard to find, but you just did. Snack on, it says. www.madminifoods.com. Oh, cool. They're in a container like cookies, like Oreos. Well, they're about the size of an Oreo, honestly. Yeah. And, and what's funny is they're lower calories than Oreo. Yeah, <laughs> an Oreo is 70 calories and these are only 60 calories. And Kevin loves ice cream. So you want to just, put just one bite or? it. I didn't know if we would need a, a knife or not. Mm. Kevin, that was really good. The cookie is soft. It's that, not hard and crunchy. It's no, soft. I expected it to be crunchy. Yeah, it's not. It's, it's a. It's a you little doughy flavor, flavored, but it tastes like um, sugar cookie dough to me. Mm -hmm. I hate to throw another brand name in here, but I'm going to because that's what it tastes like. I've had it lately and you haven't. The Halo Top. Oh, that, yeah. that ice cream reminds me of Halo Top ice cream, which I absolutely love. That is very, very good. It is good. Um, it reminds you of a, a cookie dough, though. The kind of mm -hmm. texture and the consistency reminds you of a cookie dough. Yeah, for some reason, I, when you look on the front of the box, you think a cookie, you think it's going to be a crunchy, and it's not. No, it's not. Which I'm glad, because if you get a crunchy cookie and ice cream, they don't it's mix It's hard to eat. It breaks apart and falls on the floor. This is something that you can actually keep in your hand. Um, and it, it's, you can see it, it doesn't get uh, soft quickly either. Mm -hmm. This so, is chocolate with vanilla ice cream. Mm. And there's definitely a difference. Oh yeah. That one tastes like a um, chocolate brownie almost, like a fudge brownie. Mm -hmm. It's like a dark. Yeah, it's got a little bit of that bitter chocolate flavor. Yes. Not bad. It's just got a little bit of that flavor. Yes, there. I want to eat this, but we should should I be saving one for pictures. We'll just stick it on. Off or can we Here's take a it. picture of them in the container? We'll eat a whole one. Here, just eat it. I'll gladly eat it. It's mm -hmm. very good. That one's good. I think I liked it better than the vanilla one, the blondie Did you? one. That's just me. Can we keep opening? I it? think sure. I think I like the blondie better. Yeah, like that. A little bit of a, that 
There's, bitter a, chocolate there's a little bit of a bitter chocolate. I don't mind it, but I just prefer the blondie. Okay, so this is going to be chocolate, chocolate. chocolate ice cream and chocolate cookie sandwiches. So this, that we already know that the cookie's bitter, a little bitter. So we'll see how the ice cream is. And if you get them, if you can get them to mail them to you like they mailed them to me, they were perfect. So they, you, if you saw the box opening, um, then you saw how well they were packaged. You know, I'm gonna take it back. They're not bitter. Well, they're devil's food cake bitter. They taste like devil's mm -hmm. food cake. And devil's food cake has a little bit of a bitter mm -hmm. flavor. That's what they taste like. That's really good. Now see, combined with the chocolate You like that one better? Now see, I like the vanilla one better. I don't like, it's a little too chocolatey for me for that one. This one had that little bit of offset a little bit with the vanilla. Oh no. Now see, I really, really like that, that one. Mm -hmm. That one tastes a little like a, a devil's mm -hmm. food cake, pound cake or something. That's very, very good. No now box. that one's moved to my favorite. <laughs> Let me do it. Yeah. Yeah, this one. And see, that's probably my Lisa. <laughs> It's too much chocolate. It's funny how I, everybody's different. I can never have too much chocolate, but you've liked them all. I've liked them all. That one's probably not one I would buy again. The chocolate chocolate. And this will be totally different because this is black raspberry. I love Black raspberry ice cream and chocolate cookie sandwiches. And they're pretty. You mm -hmm. definitely get that raspberry flavor. I mean, it's pretty strong. You sure do. It's Almost like a sherbet. Kind of. Mm-hmm. Hmm. That's delicious. They are, they're all really good, honestly. The chocolate What do you one, think about that raspberry flavor? It's good. It tastes like natural raspberry, honestly. Mm -hmm. It tastes like fresh raspberries that have been put in ice cream. It's very, very good. Yeah. Um, if you like the fresh fruit, um, then that it really does taste natural. Yeah. I think that's probably one of my favorite ones in the raspberry one. I like it a lot too. Although I think I really like it. I think it's used to eat an extra ice cream. I like that one too. I really do. I don't know. Here, try it again. <laughs> yeah, I think the vanilla one's my favorite. The blonde is my favorite one. My second would probably be the raspberry, and then I'd go the chocolate vanilla, and then the chocolate chocolate. I wouldn't buy again. Um. Gosh, <laughs> this is hard. Okay, my favorite is the chocolate chocolate, the one that he wouldn't buy. Right. I would buy it first. Um, that's why we end up with so much in the freezer because I buy what, what I like stuff. and buy what he likes. Okay. The second is going to be the raspberry. I really like the mm -hmm. flavor of that raspberry. The, the third is going to be the blondie. And then the, the one and I then like. The one that you second. like the most, or second. Yeah. Well, I really third. Yeah, this one is going to be my last choice. Although they're all very good. The dangerous thing is, is that just like a package of cookies in the cabinet, and these are right there and they're open and they're so easy to get to. I love the container that they're in. You can also eat one whole thing in one bite. Yeah, you can. You yeah. can eat a whole cookie in a bite? Yeah, I just did. Did you? <laughs> <laughs> did you notice? Did you notice I did? You're not supposed to. Which one did you eat? The chocolate one. Oh. I think I switched. I think that's an hour. I, I'm sorry. He's just going to keep dabbling no, I, in. I, I think I still like, I think I like this one one. The raspberry. The vanilla one too. One or two. Those are really close to each other. Probably the vanilla chocolate three and then the chocolate chocolate lie. Because this one does have a, a very bitter to me. It does. No, it does. Chocolate. It does. Well, so thank cut back you. on what, whatever is bitter in the chocolate, cut that back just a little bit. It'd be perfect. Uh, thank you very much, Aaron, Always. for reaching out to us and asking us to try these. These, in all honesty, I would we would not uh, lie to you uh these are really really good mm -hmm. uh so if you have not tried them i would i think kids will absolutely love them especially if you're in a place like we are right now where it's hot it is summer and um, this would be the perfect thing 
Uh, if you have a group of kids, uh, to give them, one. give them one, yeah, just like a popsicle or anything else, this would be perfect. Because I've noticed these are not like they're not like melting. There's no there's no melting in the bottom. Yeah, of they're the soft. Chair. They're, they're getting soft, but they're, they're not melting. Yeah, so they're perfect. So I'm sure uh, Gavin will love them. We'll have to get him to try some. So thank you very much. Like I said, if you all tried any of them, let me know which ones uh, are your favorites. And um, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I upload videos every single day. And uh, so thanks for watching.